Hey everybody, TBRG here, and I'm going to be doing a review on all the stuff that I got for Christmas. The first thing that we're going to review is the Under Armour Storm 1 jacket. The next thing is going to be the glove oil. Third is the lizard skin. Fourth is the Nike stuff, or the Nike shoes. Fifth is the Mizuno first base glove, and um, both the, or the stirrups. Okay, so the first item we are reviewing is the Under Armour Storm 1 jacket or sweatshirt. So, first thing you see is the Under Armour logo. It's a mesh fill, and it has the gray stitching. Then you go to the hoodie, and it's the silver Under Armour logo. Then you open it up, and you can see the Storm 1 jacket with the Under Armour logo. It's small. Then it is um, the metal. It's like a metal. It looks the metal, but it's not. It's plastic. So there's that. And then is it on here? No. Okay, that's it for this item. What would you rate it as a feel to wear? Ten, because it's water is um, waterproof. Yeah. Yeah. What about the inner side of the jacket? What does that feel like? Fuzziness. Fuzziness? Fuzziness. It's good. Now, it's good. what's your verbal review on this jacket? Ten. Well, like, what do you think of it? What are good things about it? Why is it a ten? Because it keeps you warm and it keeps you dry when it rains. It's good. That's why it's called a storm. Storm. Water. That's cool. Yeah. Very cool. So, next time. Do you wear it at... Baseball games and stuff? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Alright, cool. Peace out. Peace. So the next thing I'm gonna be reviewing is be reviewing is this glove oil. It's by it's made by Rawlings. Um it's it's okay. I'd I would rather prefer a um Mizuno glove oil or Wilson. Cause this is just pure liquid. Mm-hmm. The other stuff is like conditioner, which is the same. So why'd you buy it? Um, I didn't buy it. It was for Christmas. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. But it gets the job done. So just because this is a liquid, I'm probably going to give this like, well, liquid and breaking in, I'm probably going to give this a four. So it wasn't that good. And what's it called? It's, um, Rawlings. What is that? Glovo limb or something, I don't know. Alright. So your verbal review is it's not good. Yes. It's liquid. Alright. Okay, so this is the third thing that I am going to be reviewing is the lizard skin grip tape. Um, it's not that thick. My other grip tape that I just like ripped off and redid it. It was the Easton grip tape. That's way thicker than this. It's a better fill. So, it's, like, if you were to fill it, it's not that thick. On the other, Easton, it had the same exact thing like this. If you were to fill it, it was way thicker than this. So, my honesty, I would probably rate this, like, a five or six. The Why? Easton The Easton grip tape's, I'm, I'm sorry, the Easton grip tape's better. But I do like this a little bit. Just because of it was thickness? Yeah, That's thickness. It. Thickness, and it, by, when I say thickness, it's like, it was just, it felt better because, um, the grit, so. Okay. That's this. So sick. Alright. The fifth thing I'm going to be reviewing is the Nikes. So, take them out. It's a royal blue. It's very, very flexible, as you can see. And it's really lightweight because of... It's like... The, the material it's made out of. The mesh. Um, I like it because of the height. Or, not the height. The um, padding on the back. It's really comfortable. Inside, or the tongue... Is very nice. You don't feel it. 
and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. My review on this, these, probably a 10. Um, I'd prefer Nike 4.0s, but these actually are very nice. I um, like these probably better, so they're very comfortable. Yeah. What size That's is it? Size, I think it's nine and a half. Yeah, it's a nine. It's a nine. So, yeah. That's this. Cool, thank you. Okay, so the next thing we are reviewing is the Mizuno First Base Glove. It's a franchise, so you can see right there. This glove, well, where our dicks is, um, it wasn't over a hundred dollars, so it wasn't a free steam. We had to pay fifteen dollars, but it broke in pretty easy, and it's I've only had this for what day? Yeah. So yeah, and then has a strap for adjusting. Um, tan lacing, the triple or the H web. And yeah, that's it. I I rate this a ten. In my verbal, um, what is it? Review. Review. Yeah, verbal review. Um, it's, it's a nice glove for an intermediate player. Well, for an interme intermediate for space, or for just beginning, because it's a low it's low price, but good quality. So. How did you get to the first base position? Have you been playing it a long time or did you switch? Um, I didn't switch. My coach put me there because our first baseman wasn't the best. He, what he did was when he was to scoop the ball, he went like that. So he pushed the ball away instead of just absorbing. So he like pushed it and it would go out of his glove. So. Just because of okay, cool, cool. All right, cool. Thanks for the review. Mm -hmm. Last thing I'm going to be reviewing are these stirrups by MLV and the Pro Feet Athletic Socks. So I like these stirrups because the uh, of the um, elastic, and it's easy to tell front and back because this is the higher part and the lower part. So I like that, and I like these socks because they are very comfortable. Right here and right up here because they are very fuzzy. Cool. And I like the elastic on these because you they're not visible. So, yeah, my overall rating on the stirrups are probably a 10 because it's easy to tell the front and back and the comfort of the elastic. And these are 10 because it will keep you warm on very cold days. So, yeah. Yeah.